man, half woman. It's Gary. I wanna hip you to the teeth. Gary, baby. All right, y'all. Rick's about the morning show. It is five minutes after the hour. Y'all, this statement is being brought to you by my computer com- career. My computer career. That's right, y'all, family, man. Listen, hey, if you don't absolutely love what you do, you need to go to mycomputercareer.edu and take the free career evaluation today uh, and become an information technology professional. That's right. An information technology professional in as little as four months. That's my computer career.edu. Make sure y'all check it out. Gary, what you got? Good morning, Ricky. Good morning, America. Good morning to you. It's Wednesday. A beautiful, beautiful day in the neighborhood. And here's what's happening in Celebrity News, y'all. Okay, we all know, honey, there's road. The road is leading to the Oscars. The Oscars are about to come on, I guess, in a couple of weeks or whatever. And we all know that Jennifer Lopez was nominated. Well, baby, an Oscar member, or should I say a longtime Oscar Academy member by the name of Terry Moore said that the reason why that Miss Jennifer Lopez was not nominated for an Oscar was because, honey, her role in The Hustler was overrated. What? He said, but yes, he said it was overrated. You know that was overrated. I even said that mess was overrated. Now, according to the New York Post, they said Moore said that I would have been shocked if she did get it. He continued to say, first of all, Hustle Y'all is not an Oscar movie. It's a little too rough around the edges. And he said he's assuming that some other people in the acting academy didn't even see it. And he went on to say that, you know, J Lo spot, honey, for, you know, people that was in Little Women and Lady Gaga and all those people that was nominated um, last year, honey, when Lady Gaga lost to Olivia Coleman. And so, so on and so forth. She's just not an Oscar person. She's a fly girl. So I'm like, everybody hollering, oh, J-Lo should have been nominated. Uh, no, she shouldn't have been nominated. And look, the Oscar people even say the same damn thing. I know even you like J-Lo and y'all love her and stuff, but she's not an Oscar nominated person. Well, no. she's obviously not Oscar nominated. The question is, does she deserve the Oscar? And no. I actually agree with you, Gary. I enjoyed the movie Hustler. I think every actor did a great job in the film, but it is definitely not an Academy Award movie. It's not. Did, any, did anybody else see it? Did you? Did y'all see it? Brad, did y'all see it? I, I did not. It. I saw it. You saw it? What you thought about it? I thought it was good. I, I just felt like it could have been more uh, more stuff going on in it because so many things happened in these dancers' lives. Uh but I think she did good as far as a dancing and, and, and playing a good role. Mm-hmm. That's what she does. She's a dancer, not an Oscar winner. Uh, <laughs> that, don't do that. Just Gary. because you're a dancer don't mean you can't become an Oscar winner. They don't give Oscars to dance. They give them to great actors and actresses that work real hard at their craft. And like like me, I should get an Oscar for uh, my, my sitcom, Gary. What you think? Oh. That, I, <laughs> that I used to have on TV One with Ray J. <laughs> oh, yeah. I said dumb <laughs> actors. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, <laughs> Gary, you, you don't think I could have won a, a NAACP? You could get, get, get a Razzie. You could get a Razzie, but you can't get no NAACP. No Oscar, Gary, no Gary, Oscar. Gary, Gary, we, we was on for two whole seasons. Yeah, because people had to learn it. They had to see, let me be sure I'm watching what I'm watching. The set was dope, like, though, though, right? Rick, the set and they was dope. Three, three seasons, no. So, honey, but congratulations, y'all. I'm going to be smiling. So, you were doing great, honey. Keep adding. So, you don't think the little sitcom I had? What? Uh-uh. I did burn these name. chickens. I did uh-uh. the uh-uh. <laughs> They say you care about her neither, honey. The writers deserve the name. Hold on. Like, <laughs> baby, what? <laughs> Can't you the writer. You said the writers deserve one. <laughs> the writers deserved oh. an Emmy on that show. Mm-hmm. The writers oh, had man. to portray the actors. The actors had to portray the writers. You could have wrote a lot of episodes of you to put that damn cell phone down, walk around that cell phone up and get your face <laughs> <laughs> yep, but we it's gonna come back. Honey. We the win because you weren't focused. <laughs> okay. uh-huh. See that? That's why he said the writers, honey, because he knew Special what he was K. doing. Not writing. What? But, but we gonna pray, honey. And Jesus knows, Ricky. It's gonna come back um, what, next next year. It's gonna be new and improved. The Ricky Smiley Morning Show Part Three. <laughs> Wow. Oh, Ricky goes so to camp. Think you, so you don't think me and Ray, me and Ray J, you don't think, uh-uh. we, you don't uh-uh. think, you don't think we was worthy of season, season uh-uh. three? Uh-uh. <laughs> they said, uh-uh, honey. They said, you better got this season two out, honey. We sure ain't going to do no damn three. You, on, you don't think, what about, what about, what about Joe Willie to do the ramen dance? You don't think we uh-uh. had them? They said, honey, he should have stayed where he was like, who created that character? Oh, <laughs> yeah. What's your color, Gary? The color of the day is hot cocoa. The higher you say hot cocoa, the lower you say brown. That's the color. Well, <laughs> but anyway. <laughs> boy, boy, you the only somebody that don't get mad. 
Cause you know I was sensitive about my first sitcom. Oh, yes, you, you were. Don't some, you know, let me tell you something. You don't want somebody I let I let go there. Other than that, I'm gonna defend myself, but I'm gonna let you make it today. <laughs> they said those cue cards wouldn't work. <laughs> <laughs> 